Welcome to Lighthouse Kinship's devotional video, Unspeakable Joy, Psalms 94, 19, NLT. When doubts fill my mind, your comfort give me re renewed hope and cheer. Psalms 30, 11, and 12, NLT. You have turned my mourning into joyful dancing, and you have taken away my clothes of mourning and clothed me with joy. That I might sing praises to you and not be silent, O Lord my God. I will give you thanks forever. Today is Friday, July 29th, 2022. Monica and I are here at the Big Bone Lick State Historical Site in Union, Kentucky. And right now we're at the uh, Bison Observation Area. When doubts fill my mind and turmoil start seeping into my heart to steal my unspeakable joy, I take hold of my mind and heart. I remind myself of God's faithfulness and how he does not allow adversities and afflictions into my life without walking with me through each one. Colossians 3 verses 1 and 2 NLT Since you have been raised to new life with Christ, set your sights on the realities of heaven where Christ sits in the place of honor at God's right hand. Think about the things of heaven, not the things of earth. 1 John 4, verses 1, 2, and 4, TLB. Dearly loved friends, don't always believe everything you hear just because someone says it is a message from God. Test it first to see if it really is, for there are many false teachers around, and the way to find out if their message is from the Holy Spirit is to ask. Does it really agree that Jesus Christ, God's Son, actually became man with a human body? If so, then the message is from God. Dear young friends, you belong to God and have already won your fight with those who are against Christ because there is someone in your hearts who is stronger than any evil teacher in this wicked world. 2 Timothy 1 verse 7 NLT for God has not given us a spirit of fear and timidity, but of power, love, and self-discipline. Besides bringing me comfort, hope, and cheer, when doubts fill my mind and heart, my Savior and Lord turns my mourning into joyful dancing. Dancing, I enjoy a great toe-tapping beat with uplifting lyrics. It took over three decades of Bobby and I being married but I finally have my husband as my dance partner, along with my Savior and Lord. 2 Samuel chapter 6, verses 14 and 15. David and the Israelites rejoiced with shouts of joy and great toe tapping in God's presence. 2 Samuel 6, verses 14 and 15 NLT. And David danced before the Lord with all his might, wearing a priestly garment. So David and all the people of Israel brought up the ark of the Lord with shouts of joy and the blowing of ram's horns. Not only has God comforted me, given me hope, brought gladness into my heart, and given me toe-tapping moments, but he has also clothed me with his joy. Walking together has been a regular daily activity Bobby and I have done for many decades. Before he retired, our walking schedule started at 4 a.m. and our walking routine mostly was through two of the 11 subdivisions built off of our two and a half mile road. However, since Bobby's retirement and God bringing, being our tour guide, our walking path and times has taken us into many different places. What does Bobby and my walking adventure have to do with God clothing me with his joy? Our walking is where usually my unspeakable joy comes into my heart, soul, and mind. God brings into my spirit a verse, a song, or a place that overflows me with his unspeakable joy, no matter what our circumstances are at the present time. Isaiah 61, verses 10 and 11, the message. I will sing for joy in God, explode in praise from deep in my soul. He dressed me up in a suit of salvation. He outfitted me in a robe of righteousness. 
as a bridegroom who puts on a tuxedo and a bride a jeweled tiara. For as the earth burst with spring flowers and as a garden cascades with blossoms, so the Master, God, brings righteousness into full bloom and puts praise on display before the nations. Is there a specific place, time of day, or activity that Jesus Christ is in your midst bestowing unspeakable joy into your heart, mind, soul, and spirit, no matter the doubts that are invading your mind or the fear seeping into your heart and soul? Zephaniah 3, verse 17, New King James. The Lord your God in your midst, the Mighty One will save. He will rejoice over you with gladness. He will quiet you with His love. He will rejoice over you with singing. This concludes our devotional video of Lighthouse Kinship, Unspeakable Joy, Habakkuk chapter 3, verses 17 to 19 in LT. Even though the fig trees have no blossoms, and there are no grapes on the vine, and even though the olive crops fails, and the fields lie empty and barren, and even though the flocks die in the fields, and the cattle barns are empty, yet I will rejoice in the Lord. I will be joyful in the God of my salvation. The Sovereign Lord is my strength. He makes me as sure-footed as a deer, able to tread upon the heights. Monica and I thank you for traveling along with us today at the Stone Lick Covered Bridge over Stone Lick Creek, Batavia, Ohio. Come along and journey with us by subscribing to our channel. Hit that little notification bell so that you won't miss our next stop. And please give us a thumbs up, liking our videos, and help us to spread the gospel by sharing these videos on your social media platforms. Thank you for leaving your comments below on how these devotions are helping you and also your prayer requests so that we know how to pray for you.